<clears throat> Yo. Vulgar Platypus Bobby McBob Captain G. Thank you for subscribing. Canar TV, not Boone. Thanks for subbing Canar for three years. Latinum or Etnam. Thanks, man. BND. Forever Pooper. Dr. Hallbrook. Thanks for subbing. Notorious S. Guy Dietrich. Aaron. Pyroruka. Alpha Ducks. Blue Gobbo. Thanks for subbing. some stolen goods, eh? Bleed out. <laughs> please, please, 
Oh, yeah. Hey, are you alright? Yes. Yeah, you okay? Alright. <laughs> Oh, I'm not even bleeding. Let me have units responding to the laundromat. It's really one of your thoughts on it. Boy, it's 7 and 6. It's really one of your thoughts on it. It's 10 and 9. Are you responding to the laundromat? Hey, food we do. Okay, 311, your call sign, please. Just us, sir. Wookie, we're in route. I believe I heard Cassidy potentially stretching up on the other one. I believe McNulty will be in route once he's finished up at Christian Road. I went from 7 LP 76 momentarily. Copy. Just when you're on scene through one, you're contacted so I can tell you. Uh, 11623, we got a gray in color four door vehicle. I got eyes on several individuals inside. There's a hostage with wearing red senior buns uniform. I'm approaching that to make contact. One tree, scuff mobile, 76 laundromat. Did our liveries fuck up? What, Letty. <laughs> Personal cars all white after a storm? Ew. I want one, three, three. I want you handling negotiations. I'm gonna have Cassidy relay what you're hearing. Let's have who's the unit in the CPI? Is that you, Lenny? There 159. You 159, I want you blocking off that side entrance right there. The one the little gap right there. Perfect. I want to see myself. I'll start taking photos. McNulty's gonna be negotiating. Let me have the CPI. I go up next to McNulty and relay what he is saying and the negotiations and terms. A one two three. I'm also. I'm gonna want to take the hostage. I'm in the V star. You don't need a front lap, buddy. Copy. I got you. Got no budget. I think Labadaddy owns V star in the city anyway. Frost, get out of the seat. Let's go. Roll. Any EPA? Three bikes. My personal scout has no livery for some unknown reason. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll be back. 
1976. Do you, uh, do you need a dash nose at all? Uh, stand by with 197 and uh, Lenny, we should be all good. Dispatch, could we get a channel for the laundromat robbery, please? 176, how about I grab a bike while my liver you know is what? fucked? Grab a motorcycle, I want you on parallel, anticipating a motorcycle swap. You're going to be on freeways and setting up for spikes once it's cleared. Yes, sir. I need you relaying negotiations of what McNulty's saying. Well, right now they're forcing the hostage to dance. There's four inside. He said, Bobby, sorry, I'll... three. Stand by. Now I need you to start looking at the individuals. You also going to be McNulty's eyes and ears while he's focused on negotiations. I want you to relate to me what they're saying, what they look like, and who's going in and out of the bag, okay? For we have one maid with a white helmet carriers. We have one rat man with a checkered black and gray color shirt, and one man with a black motorcycle helmet and a white t-shirt. Everyone but the maid is breaking open the machines. Bobby, is the plate of the vehicle been flagged? Hey, firm. Bobby. I accidentally struck their car. I was. No problem. How many total do you see inside, Price? I gotta Three. get some snackies, dude. Neither of them have gone in the back yet. Okay, they need uh, exactly two minutes. And Shocker, uh, they want free passage to the car, no spike strips, no spike strips upon exiting. Oh, I don't think we've spikes from the beginning. Oh, copy. Yeah, they, they just don't, you know, free passes, no spikes, you know, the usual. But they want anything else, and they said no. Um, uh, I'll take the hostage out. They see they need about a minute and a half, so stand by. Copy. How many do you see total? How many have they said they have? 133, three, if you can get confirmation of how many of them are inside for me. Four. And ask them. Four. Sorry, three inside, but I think they slipped and they might have one waiting somewhere else. Where's the freaking bike? I price. I'm gonna have you stay with McNulty after he takes the hostage. You help him clear it. You document Police the bike. with him. Okay. They want us to know that they're gonna ERP on Discord later. Uh, okay. Uh. All right. I have one IFAC. Dispatcher, we get a channel for this, please. Dispatcher, send seven. Okay, stand by. I'll grab us a channel. I'm uncomfortable and I'm stepping out real quick. Alright, once uh, you've seen two units on scene at the laundromat and units attaching, go to channel two for the laundromat situation. This thing blows. <laughs> Wait, maybe we got a wheelie. Two. Radio check. Radio check. And two, you guys ready to go? All They're ready to go. On frequency, stand by, stand by. Pursuit order is going to be passed to your primary. I will have myself secondary. Torres, uh, scout your tertiary. Would I get uh, Lenny? He's going to be on motor. He's going to be paralleling and setting up in areas where they're going to be swapping or have motorcycles, freeways, and whatnot. And we're ready. Right, I'm going to come up. This guy changes rims. Cassidy, you ready? Miss, I need you to wait here. Channel 2, everybody, channel 2. Okay, wait. Uh, yeah, we gotta wait. We're coming out the now. positioning is kind of blocking uh, out. the Taurus coming out. Watch out, Maple. I just don't want this uh, grind band coming out to anything. Yeah, copy. Alright, be advised they are mounting up. All three inside. They could take it off. 116, secondary 80. Green color Lapidati, 1090. Laundromat occupied three times. Left, eastbound Carson. That flag weather clear. Continuing eastbound. Approaching Glory Lowenstein crossing. Who's sending it towards you Jamestown can't now? Really with this thing, dude. Tape's open. Copy that. Did you see anyone going in and out the back? Either a rat, rat man or white shirt. 
Coffee target is either Rat Matt or White Shirt. Northbound Pop, Gimler Street. Driving on the sidewalk, Nav Speeds 100. Swerving, correct lane, passing frigid. Who's ending it now? Slowing left westbound capital. Mamma mia. In the bridge, approaching the south side. Left southbound, or to Little Big Old Merchant Glory Lowenstein now south. I see McDonald parking garage still south out Roy Lowenstein. Approaching Dutch London, stand by, slowing right west oh, westbound Dutch London. As in by approaching Maze Bank Arena, stand by. Maintaining right at the port. Continuing middle, correction, on to Dutch London westbound. Moving incorrect, taking the exit forward Dutch London, I believe. And by incorrect lane. Going northbound now, this loops all the way. Going to go down towards South Arsenal and Alka here. Going eastbound now, Davis. Pushing Mace Bank. Taking the bridge towards Grove Street Gas. Eastern yeah, 20 and climbing. The advice of coming. Again, there's a train here, slowing. No eastbound, Davis crossing Carson. Mama Mia. Right, south on McDonald's work carriage. Driving on the sidewalk. Speeding vehicles on Lowenstein. Crossing Lowenstein. Still eastbound McDonald's. Approaching Little Bighorn. Right. Direction. Left. Northbound Little Bighorn. In the low ramp. Up towards Yellow Cage Motel. Stand by. Yellow Cage. Left. Westbound. Innocent. Continuing now towards Davis. Crossing Lowenstein. Still westbound. They're circling around the south side. Which is Capital Gas. Now northbound, Anderson, merging Elgin. Left, westbound, Adam Depp, passing the ammunition. Left, southbound, into the south side on power. In the act now, approaching behind Forum, slowing. Out onto Forum, crossing. Continuing in the alley, still southbound towards Strawberry. Nice. Right. with a. I'm Scarlet Climber. Continuing northbound, Strawberry left, westbound, Innocent, holding right, northbound, Elgin. Hold said that northbound, Elgin, passing Legion Square, left, westbound, San Andreas. Watch your free route for soup. Right, northbound, Alta Street. They like to go through right, there. Right, eastbound integrity. Right, southbound strawberry. Vehicle flight 1050, still mobile, right westbound, disregard, continuing southbound strawberry. I'm searching for park square. bikes? No, I was trying to right, obstruct them. Vespucci. Vehicle hard 50. Gonna be turtled in front of the Flip. bank. Legion Square, Legion Square against 77 is down here. Let's get them boxed up against the wall. Gentle, gentle. Yeah, be careful I for interference vehicles to come in. You need to stay mobile. I don't want everyone out. Then you keep circling around, and I want the scout circling around this well. You guys stay mobile. Myself, Cassidy, and the CBPR will dismount. Individual in white is running south. Individual in white is also running south. There's one more occupant in the vehicle. Fucking Remember, you're gonna want rat mask or or white shirt. Rat mask is still in the car. We got uh, with the made outfits 195. 195, 295. Last one is the rat mask in the vehicle. Direct there. There's a vehicle pulling black and color. I'm sure we're making model. Warning. Got a something on scene. Warn them if they don't Just leave. Start boxing up. that vehicle. He's entering it. Black salt and black salt has a rat mask. PSDR and Taurus, I want you on that vehicle. Bring back the other 95s to the scene the flipped car at. The Is easier scene, you okay if all those PBS in this car? A firm, go for it. That, I chased that car last night. You you, you got to be in your A-plus game to even keep up with that shit. Oh, I've only had one cup of coffee. Oh, going to be southbound. Uh, McDonald is 50 with a Taurus. Hard 50 left, eastbound Davis. We're going eastbound, Davis Ave. Left, northbound, Innocent Boulevard. What is that? 
This thing's gonna have much better acceleration than I. Northbound Elgin past the scene. Yikes. Breaking by scene, breaking by scene. They're trying, to, they're trying to spot their boy. Right. Disregard left west with Spucci. Minotti, do you want me to attach this? Yes, I need I'm a torsion. Just... I, okay. I need a torsion yeah. on this. I'm here. I'm, I'm behind you. Attached. Take uh, take primary from me. Uh, I'm gonna hold secondary. Right? This thing just has better acceleration, but I'll dust it on a highway. Right northbound Alpha. All right. The thing has What's better acceleration and top him. <laughs> the car that they're chasing. Wait, he's found the spoochie. Bomb attached. Secondary comms. Team. The scene. He's found the spoochie. I just, I just crashed into someone and that's Where it. Where you going, buddy? Oh. Strawberry. Oh, just going for a ride. What's up? Yeah, I hope so. Going northbound to Los Santos Freeway. Oh. I have no idea what things top end is like, but I should be okay. We're pushing northbound Ellis Freeway, passing the casino, secondary VCB. Standing up on the exit, stand by. Going straight, straight, hold straight, hold straight north. When I, when I hold control, so, wait, I, uh, I, wait, I'm wheeling. Kind of. Priorities in this vehicle, rat mask. The northbound, low Santos freeway. This bike sucks dick, dude. Well, the turbo, it's probably okay, low though. Santos freeway, parallel wind farms. Break, break, we got the coins and cash on white shirt. The mask was still fiddling around. Probably still shit on him. It's your call, is he still northbound? It's north freeway. Yeah, stick on it. You got enough units, go for it. Does not need turbo go in any vehicle? Stand by. Hard break, hard break, hard break. Still northbound routes to north freeway. Some Pass, of the motor pool cars didn't have a turbo slot. Hard breaking. Slot. Like the first two horses. Taking the off ramp back uh, southbound, out up to 68, stand by. Right westbound, disregard. Continuing southbound to north freeway. So southbound to North Freeway, passing Bowling Brook. So southbound to North Freeway, we're just Bowling Brook now. Parallel of Fuente Blanca. Why no helmet? Why? You, you think Lenny, Lenny wears liberal shit like a helmet, dude? Southbound to South Freeway. Are you able to keep up in the straight? Is it good? Yes. Hyper focus. Southbound, south, low centers freeway. Yeah, I'm surprised they failed handcuffs the first round. It must be new. That's cool though. Going off road, parallel uh, southbound Elgin Ave. Unless it was part of the plan, dude. So southbound Elgin Ave. Hard break, right. Westbound, Ash Ave. Right to that Vinewood Boulevard. Left, south, power. I need a Taurus here, look at his split. Yard, left, eastbound, Spanish. Left, northbound, Meteor. Right, eastbound, Vinewood Park. The eastbound, Vinewood Boulevard, past the casino. Hard break, entering the casino parking lot. I'm a cop. Oh, thank God. Hold on, I'll give you. I'm a hold left. I'm a hold left. Gaming Jacob and Cop, thanks for left. subbing. Okay, we are northbound Bible Park Drive, entering in. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm. You call it. Call it. I'm gonna go around. Copy that. We're continuing eastbound. We're getting onto the actual horse track. We might you be taking a jump. Taking a jump. Call. Uh, there might be a jump if we keep sending it southbound. There might be a jump. Another one. Another one. Another one. I know the one. I'm waiting, right here. We're still going around in circles. I do not believe we're taking it. But there might be a black ingot behind you, brother. Negative, no. Oh, so it was the rat mask got out of the car. There's a motorcycle. Where? Uh, in the parking lot. They are going I got, I got eastbound it. towards Mirror Park Boulevard. VCB. I can't keep up with that fucking motorcycle anyway on this shit, dude. 
Put eastbound towards Mirror Park. Uh, one outside, I'm trying to cut them off at San Andreas and El Rancho. Uh, motorcycle, uh, color. Silver, coming out of the lost compound. It's going to be on Vinewood Park. On Boulevard. Some direction. You can believe ECB. You guys in the, the car still, Leo? I think hey, I have car. the motorcycle break. I think I have the motorcycle at Mirror Park. Stand by. Silver, driver's wearing majority green, but rat mask on the back. Yeah, yeah, he's in Mirror Park. He's uh, uh, going out. Stand by. I think I'm in Mirror Park at the gas station, uh, southbound through the alleyways. Fuck, oh, man, that bike's quick. Uh, continuing right westbound. Stand by. ECB, gotta got get go through Mirror Park, uh, parallel to the lake. It's going around towards San Andreas. He's taking the slip off the road southbound towards Elgin, Elysian Fields, BCB. Seen towards Elysian Fields off road. He didn't come to San Andreas, I didn't see him. He might have slipped down to, um, Makalak. Leon, are you still on the Karuma? A perm. I got it northbound, right eastbound onto Del Perro Freeway. It's just trying to highway blast me now. Z's, this is on an interference car. What do you want us to do? Hey, was this the one that picked up the rat? Is the rat still inside? It is. The rat, okay, the, the, rat, rat is still the rat is no longer in here, but it picked it up before. Then if, they, if you guys don't have him and you don't think he's going to be coming back, we have the 295s and the... I have the car. It's out. Going. It's out on the freeway. Del Perro Freeway. Go, go, go. go. Stick on him. Yeah, good. All right. We're good there. We, we, I want that car. On that 706. We should up there on him. Leon, are you on your own, brother? Leon. 10-9. Keep talking, please. We're still on the freeway. He got in the back seat. Tase him. He's... Getting into the passenger seat now. Can't make that jump. That's a good days going for cuffs. Is this rubber a homeless guy? Suspect resisted running northbound. Uh, disregard. Southbound of the red garage. Southbound of red garage. Still on the freeway. Up with Laporta. 23. Jumping down. We were northbound towards Del Perro. Now east, now running northbound towards Ginger. Continuing northbound ginger running towards the garage. No, I... Running eastbound Vespucci. No way he is. He's that car. 197, I'm going to go back to the vehicle and document that. We're going to stay with him on that pursuit. <laughs> Stop. Stop running! I'm getting up, Lenny. Oh. Holding taser, oh, holding taser. Oh, he was on the other side of the wall. <laughs> it looked like he tackled him through the wall. Don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> Back towards. Sorry about this, sir. Good. I wasn't raised correctly. I'm <laughs> sorry. We're running towards Senior Buns westbound.
I'm gonna wait at the front door. Just got a uh, white bike that just pulled up. I think he's going around to the back. Negative. Hey, what if I kick that guy on the white bike if he tried to pull up and grab this guy? We have a suspect that came back on a motorcycle in the rat mask. Going for cuffs. Well, over cuffs. Go to there we go. Hawk, are you able to pursue the motorcycle? Absolutely not. Did really, dude. Mother. <laughs> <laughs> Confirm if it's the same guy in the same rat mask. And four. That's the case, then uh, get him too while we're at it. I'm gonna bring your cars over there, boys. Okay. Oh, oh my ah. god! Oh my. Are you alright? Oh, oh <laughs> Why did he run in front of the car? I did not have a place, Mark. <laughs> Why did he do it? Says nothing. Sometimes silence is the best answer, dude. Uh, is someone with the original car back on Del Perno? Hey, from 197. I'll document the white bike. <laughs> Burp, burp, burp. Never take responsibility. <laughs> I take responsibility all the time. One five nine. Do we know who was your driver? Well, I believe that was Marty Banks. At least that's the RO of this vehicle. What do you mean of the uh, one six nine? I got it. Well, we're talking. Why can't I right get the plate? Dispatch, what's the status on the Chennai? Hey, from yo, I believe we have two in custody that are receiving, that are being processed right now. Unsure of the other pursuit that was taking place. I believe we have four in custody in total. Cassidy, McNulty, you guys caught two more over there, right? Oh, four. God. Hey, firm. We have everyone involved in custody currently. Jam full, good work. You played cop for months and still never remember I to read the from plate dispatch. from front? Oh, excuse me for trying to read the plate on the back. Thank you, dispatch. Chairman for dispatch from back channel one. Uh, yeah, officer. Cassidy and McDonald, do you guys collapsing back good to this uh, Sultan? Or am I good to just get it? Uh, uh, get it no, out. I think you're good over there. Uh, I already have tow on the on the route. I have it fully documented. I'll escort it to impound and get it marked up there. Uh, Joyride. Kappa lol. Where's my bike? Laundromats. Marty. Uh, is EMS on freak? Uh, Drop it over to one. 
vehicle. Marty Banks, you rat mask guy. L Hawk. Pay uh charge him with joyriding and tampering with a vehicle. Needs other applicable charges for trying to pick up friend with stolen white sports bike. Wait, I don't think I saved him. Radio check. Dead two. Dead My suspect Marty Banks has a firearm on his possession. I'm gonna add that to his charges. It is a issued licensed firearm. Is it his? One at seven seventy six impound lot with that black Sultan uh, Mark II. I was gonna flag this up for reckless evading. M4. Texas. Copy. Does anybody know? To, uh, on the radio, sorry. Marty Banks has a weapons license. Not issued to him. <clears throat> Does anybody know if we found a USB on any of them? Ooh, never mind. Negative, negative, negative. It, it is issued to him. Sorry, I was looking at the expiration date and thought it was this fucking. So what's the protocol here, right? Because kidnapping, violent felony, removed. A firm. Um, I don't think he gets a specific gun charge though. Uh, criminal use of a firearm? Wouldn't that be stacking with kidnapping though? On that seven twenty three impound with that black sultan. He didn't. He just had the gun on him. He wasn't waving it around at the laundromat, too. That's the thing. Um. Nice middle finger. Three eight six two. So, McNulty, question. The Sultan here is R.O. Marty Banks, and Marty Banks was involved in the robbery, but the driver and the vehicle itself was not, and it was just used as, as a, a vehicle to... Yes, but we can, we can articulate that because he was part of the part of the right. crime, and there's no tampering that he willingly gave it to his friend. Okay, so then you want me to hit this with a violent felony, then? No, stop it for reckless evading. Okay, that's what I wanted to confirm. Thanks, I didn't do anything. I, I saw you swing your leg out a couple of times. Oh, yeah. I guess I did knock him off, huh? Yeah, yeah. It was quite, quite good. You know, people never remember the small victories, only the large mistakes. All right, uh, they're all medic up. Let's go. Oh, you can do a wheelie from a uh, start. You owe me $4. I'm sorry. That's all I have. I'm we sorry. We remember this. One seven six. I went ahead and removed uh, his weapons license. Anybody uh, with my Taurus on the freeway? From that so, 311? Yeah, no. Uh, yeah. Um, I can't get it. Cassidy, can you not get back to that car? Awesome. I want to play Lenny as the straight. Copy. I can have, I can have a tow truck driver. No laughing. No smiling. If you wouldn't mind, that would be very helpful, Michael. Thank you. I'll pay you if it costs you anything. 
I can always gonna go pick that up and uh, and transport them. RPD, I just had her drop off the uh, malt, the Sultan and impound that. Thank you. Just get a turbo in this. One nine seven seventy six of RPD. Moon got a talking to. Transition channel one. Pardon? Good work, everybody. <laughs> by the way, we fucking psycho. got all good shit, guys. Good shit. Has to be personal for a turbo. Oh. Fix your car in PD Benny's. I'm waiting to do it because it's nighttime and I'm not sure any mechanics are working. Stolen white bike. Late read. Wait, was that the bike or the play read? Man. Don't forget to put a dash cam in. Hey, some dash cams. I don't actually know how to put a dash cam in. the other two suspects. Did you send him up? I price uh, three on one, let the OC know that you sent him up, but for how long? And if it's a uh, violent I, crime in nature. There's no DLC on the on that. Yeah, still do it to make it very a habit for you, okay? Marty's requesting a bench trial. He wants to represent himself. <laughs> Marty, requesting a bench trial. Okay. I am just uh. in photos. Let me get all of your statements. Is this shit still doing it? It's still doing it. Big, biggest thing. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. So, What's going on? that ha are you talking about like not being able to get into the report? No, report, looking at it, and then upgrading it to an incident, and it loses the info I had in it before. Oh. Yeah, yeah. That's a I had to save it. I didn't think about that, but it's okay. Hey, was, was we know Larry was in the bank or in the laundromat?
Cash, are you still on radio? Hey, firm. Got your Taurus back, bringing the motor pool for you. Thank you very much, brother. Do, how much do I owe you? Uh, she didn't ask for any payment for this one. I have to talk to O and or McNulty about it because it's his girl. How about that? Uh, your tourist is parked across from the white scout in the motor pool. I actually don't know what happened. We gotta ask. So, with the wrench out, trying to wait for me to walk around. I went to the other side and I jumped over and I said, let me see some hands. Leon. What's up? I'll do it. So what happened uh, on the highway? Uh, I might punch you. Wait, why? I never mind. I'm good. What happened on the freeway? Yeah. How did, how did that guy you guys were chasing out of Vespucci come to be? I don't know. Well, you better remember, because this guy's requesting a bench trial. <laughs> the guy that I just sent away? No, Marty Banks. I had, rat, Marty was rat in the... mask. The guy who was driving the white bike oh, to pull it. Oh, he pulled up to cut, try to pick up Larry. All right. And then we tased him off his bike three times. Well, I kicked him off twice. Yeah. That was it. He just showed up, but... Uh, I believe McNulty confirmed that he was uh, with them. Like he was wearing the exact same outfit from earlier. Uh, uh, McNulty and... One, two, five, I'm going to put my cast. statement in. I'll give my whole statement. I'll write everything. Uh, near senior if he was wearing the same outfit, uh, which you look at the photos... He is, he's in the bank Knox. or in the laundry mat. So Larry Knox was on the phone and summoned forth. Are you guys trying to figure out who was inside? Larry I have Banks. a picture of them. Yeah, no, I think we got it. Thank you though. Alright. Uh White sports bike only to be super kicked off by. <laughs> Cassidy, in order to attempt to handcuff the two individuals, the rat mask, Marty Banks. The last person to be handcuffed after being kicked off of the white bike in question one more time, as well as having to be tased two or three times. Mm, let's do three times. El Hawk proceeded to document the white bike. Did little else. Three three are you still on frequency? Four. I'd say if you do already have a photo of him, it's gone. Have him put on his mask and take a photo so it matches him in the laundromat as well. Yeah, I will in a moment. Oh, shit. Ah! I wish there was an MDT hotkey. That would solve this. Let's see, Vittorio, 
Would you look at that? Not a felon. Tony Corleone. Uh, was a felon. Larry Knox. Was a felon. I don't think Marty was a felon. Nope. He was not. So, Marty Banks and Vittorio DiCenzo, two new felon arenos, dude. Normally, I wouldn't put Eclipse on this because we weren't that involved, but we did get that clutch kick on the bike. And then again. Kicking a bike is wild. Why, dude? Tell me why. First time chatter. Please do. I would love to hear your explanation for that. Kicks are deadly. None of them got knocked out. Please explain. <laughs> you can't. What was that dude's name? Hang on. Um. Bam. I'm happy with that kick. How long is this old soach stream? I'm leveling construction right now. We gotta call a hubcap today. I don't know what we can do for that investigation. Depends on what, uh... Cornwood says. You know, we went... Right. So is it going to bench? Is he gonna wanna go to bench as well? Not him. He hasn't mentioned anything. He just wanted who, you down who, here. Who is this? This is Hi. a Miss Bruno Sweeney. Let me How's it going? He's a legal aid for one of the individuals here. So you and I are gonna be You're a legal aid? Uh, yeah, he was there. <laughs> I've been requested, yeah. What's up? You're I you're can <laughs> And you got your statement and all evidence in? Sure did, sir. Uh, good shit. Keep it up, Lenny. Are you able to use a baton from bike? Uh, yeah, I think so. Yes, I do. 
there you go. All right. Senior officer. Yes. I'd like to speak with you, please. Okay, let me just get her some of the evidence. I'll be right there, okay? Two seconds. Right, use this. Boom, boom. Charges are, he is looking at one count robbery, one count accessory to, yeah, robbery resisting, a one count accessory to kidnapping. He's looking at three charges, okay? Just one second. All right, Lenny, come here. Let's run up. That woman's not the yellow pages and she doesn't have a bar license. Who called her down here? Have legal aids don't have bar license with their legal aids. Well, who called her down here, sir? He requested her. And I asked him if he had uh, anyone specific he'd like to request. I called her down. I, I've never seen her down here. <laughs> but there's a lot of legal aids. I don't, have you seen? But my, my point is, is I don't think she's a legal aid, sir. She's not a legal aid? She's not in the yellow pages. <laughs> Hang on, hey, that's impersonation. If it's the case. Did she say she was a legal aid? She did say she's a legal aid. Ask her which lawyer she's working for. I'm approaching. I got some questions. I got some questions. We're like on on a scene right now. We're not here. For PD. Uh, what Hello? what what is happening? Uh, I'm teaching them how to process. Oh. So I'm pretending to be a criminal. You look like a very f fine criminal, ma'am. Thank you. You yeah, I worked I worked hard on this outfit. Proceed, cadet. Thank you. Well, we're going over here, so start with that. Why? She wants to start uh, at the end of the just, tunnel. Oh, just all to right. get out of people's way. Yeah, there's some people down there right now. Oh yeah, should I even bring you in the cells if there's like actual 95s and shit? Uh, we can wait a little bit until it okay. clears out. Okay. All right, it might it so, might be a little bit. So, uh, just been arrested. We gotta fix our car, dude. How you fix the shit in your car? I don't know. I don't know. Christopher Watt. Thoughts on Brighter Shores trailer? Same creator as RuneScape? Yeah, it looks like a game that's being made by the guy who made RuneScape, dude. Boom. True, dude. Go in, please. What the fuck? Wait, whose car is that? It's by Cornwood. What? Yeah, that's hey, Lenny. Cool. Yeah. Can you can you access the bennies right next to me? Uh probably. No, it doesn't look like it. Yeah, let me let me move. No no, no it's fine, continue. I gotta I gotta think about something anyway. White Scout looks good. Yeah, it looks good, but it's not <laughs> protocol, dude. Uh, more tri-tip? Nah, man, I ate all that shit, dog. On G. Undercover? What's undercover about this? It's bright white. Uh, 
what did I do last night after stream? I hopped on Max and I played some RuneScape. World win? Dude, right now. Hold on. Looks like. I'll be back.
do we have numbers on the top of our cruisers now that just they're weird and not call signs? What? What up, dude? What up, dude? <laughs> A number of different cars that are like that. Are you still um, using the, the Benny Reno? I am, but you, I think you should be able to use it now. Backing up, I'm backing up, I'm backing up. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, what, what do you think of the uh, new light bars, Lenny? Is that two different light bars? It's all three of them. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it looks dumb as shit, but, uh... <laughs> um... Where's the livery? Oh my god... Livery... Nope... Wait... This is gonna be an actual fucking beat. Did it always say police interceptor? I guess so. Yeah, I kind of just want to take the uh, the grill and the the lights off, and just not use it. Uh, oh, uh, also, they uh, I don't know I don't know if you heard me, Lenny. I was just telling Bay, state mechanics. Uh, I talked to them today, and they said that they uh, they replaced the paneling on these cars with uh, something a lot more durable. Uh, really? So you think they won't crash? Uh, they won't get wrecked as often? Yeah. Apparently uh, they took oh uh, they took the good paneling off of a bunch of cars and they were uh, you know doing some research but they put the good paneling back on. It wasn't just the PD vehicles; it was uh, the PD ones and then a few other ones. So around the city. So good news. Oh yeah. Um. Won't break after a single pit. Yeah. Yay. Yeah, I'm trying to think like uh, <laughs> wider wheels are better. Uh, Is that gonna get some really fat tires? Is that gonna give us like better traction? Mm. But, but uh, yeah, the cost is slowing us down. I don't know. Mm. How do I make the wheels bigger? Maybe, maybe. How do I make the wheels bigger? Uh, the uh, you need to go to the stancer options in the uh, uh over at the catalog. Yeah, which one? Hi. Uh, it's just, it's just... <laughs> Wheel camber? Is there two light bars on your car? There's three. What? what? Oh uh, gosh, it's width. It's shape? just stands her width. Uh, <laughs> I mean, actually, mine just had this. Huh? Yeah, I was just. <laughs> hey, by the way, uh, I, I just uh, talked to one of the state mechanics, and uh, good. They they fixed our cars breaking, falling apart super fast. Uh, oh. They 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 added better better paneling back. Uh, they used to have better width. paneling, and then they got rid of it and they put it back in. Wow. Okay. I need like bigger wheels. Uh, yeah, but they're. Whoa. Those aren't right. Sorry, my, my voice is bad, by the way. My my throat's still. Will you st stop feeling. apologizing. Gorewood. I think that's the fourth time just, that I've I heard you feel say like, that. I just today. feel like I sound like such a pussy. It's just it. No, you're fine. 
What uh, what do you remember about being stabbed on the beach? Uh, let me let me go over the report. Actually, I still haven't gotten a chance to do so. But it, but I'll I'll go ahead and go over the report and uh, see if it can help me jog my memory. Uh, zoom out. Won't wider tires fuck you in a squeeze? Um, potentially, but at the same time, this car can't really make squeezes anyway. <laughs> oh. I wanted a higher suspension to see if I can uh, get over stairs better. Wait, from where? Mm -hmm. Where that come Change from? rims for uh, bigger wheels? From Viv. Probably an announcement in meeting room. It's a big meeting day. Or something. I don't know. SUV. I don't know. I'm gonna go check it out. Okay. Which one? Windows are already tinted. Hey Lenny, what is your what is your suspension set to? All the way up. <laughs> Off road might have bigger wheels. I wonder if we I wonder if we lose speed. Nah, I like the SUV ones more. Uh, let's do this for now. Pay via banking card. Off-road will have better grip. We don't know though. Sorry. There was someone there. What the fuck? <laughs> what is happening? Channel one, sir. Channel one. Pull it off if you think it's too bad. Reed Twatter, he's plotting out. Uh, that there's free money here, so just be careful of civilians and people showing up to try to pick this up. Blue car pulling in. You want dispatch track landing in? Let's get barriers up, actually. Let's get barriers no, up and no one's to oh. come in. Barriers, anyone got a barrier in their vehicle? Just put some barriers no, in the vehicle. You can, but the thing is, is we're gonna, there's too many of them to focus all at one go. There is one person that's got a, uh, that's got a warrant at the moment as well. I'm just gonna go grab some barriers. Are starting to leave. Hello. Mm -mm. Numer OSRS okay. drop Are party at PD. Hey, from this is illegal money. money. This is group six pallet money. Greetings. I need, you, uh, need to, repair. I need you to uh, actually, maybe I do need a repair. Yeah, bro. Yeah, give me a one engine part, and I need you to apply a uh, Benny's order. Okay. Give me it. Boom. I'll, uh, Lock your I'll doors, do the people. Benny's stuff, and then I'll. Uh... Okay. And stuff How much down. for applying the Benny's order? Uh, nothing. And how much for the uh, the one engine part? somewhere else they may not stay Randall bro, bro. let's do been having issues with that uh, ask Sherry Jeez. 160 bucks all right twice. thank you for honey yeah with a shitload of money uh, didn't check didn't check what dude Uh, if, if one of you is good, get, if, if you're in a vehicle and you're sat there, just 
Stay on the megaphone. If I don't think people can take the, the turbo unless, unless there's a... Uh, unless the... Uh, the hood open, right? I don't know. Hey. Do you want Money. To moving power? Thank you, Lenny. Yeah, jump in. How do you do, Liam? Hello, Great. Very good. It was just, it was just the suspension yeah, wheels sure no and um, delivery, Someone stand right? Yep. On the bridge, please. Someone, All right. Like, uh, you the should bridge. be gooch. Make not sure it's parked. Bridge. All right. Not on the bridge. Have a good one, Lenny. Thank you. Wait, did Stand you put the board the in? Oh, wait, no, I forgot about that. Be ready to be mobile Please. for James Kelly. Forgot about it. You're down, man. Pop, the head. Like, pop it on. Yeah, I think so. Hell yeah. This thing is lifted. Yeah, I can't see it, so. <laughs> oh, yeah, I gotta park it up. Yeah, it's it is it is a lifted and a half. It like it definitely screams you, Lenny. It definitely screams you. Thank you for the engine part, sir. Yeah, of course. There's uh looks like Mr. K and Peanut have gone around. They're on the staircase at the side of We're gonna find a place to park it. Whoa. Is that local? James has been pushed down by Kurt. Officers, get James, please. It's still, it's poor James. The boy's on, dude. The freaking boy, dude. Can we just get everybody on the scene arrested for trespassing, or...? He, he was, he was dropped in. I'm just thinking about, because he, he did. That was me, was fuck you. Else. Dude, I'm fuck also you, man. I'm all of the BBFC who are just refusing to leave. Oh, okay. Oh, the wheels got bigger. Call on this. Do we want us to arrest everybody? Can't tell if the suspension is higher. Hey. I, I do have a uh, suggestion here. Uh, I think it would be wise to take these pallets. Let's go see. Pallet and your slaughter. Uh, know who they're stolen from, whatever, uh, we could maybe eventually take these and uh, give them to our six drivers who maybe have uh, like one or two pounds stolen and we can't finish our job with one of these. Oh my god. Are we going to arrest these individuals? Yeah, uh, yeah arrest them. But, uh, if the situation breaks down, there's a lot of people there. Someone on the bridge is trying to keep growing. <laughs> Does that affect your turning? Turning feels the same. Try to raise the suspension. Who? James is getting in the Why are you doing that? van. That's just so it's easier to go over right stuff. Also, the thing's gonna handle worse, right? Uh, clip easier. Yeah, we'll see. I guess. Back in the van. What? Driving the up. Fuck? All right, the first taking off. James's van is the second from last. <laughs> no. No what? No. No what? No, that's too yeah, lifted. What do you think this is? A goddamn right. lifted truck, man? There's no rule against this. <laughs> yes, there is. It's part of the uniform, man. I'll tell right? you how I know, because I tried doing the same thing. And they told me this vehicle or not Show yet. me where it's written and I won't do it. This is true. Right. <laughs> uh, yeah, we need a pursuit leader who's on the actual Do what you want, I'm going to a bench. Right. Pursuit, Wait, do you need me? No, I mean, if you want to, you can come. If you got both of you, I don't know if you want to come, but... Well, who is it uh, for? Um, 
Monty Are we playing PBS on this vehicle currently? Yeah, I kicked him off that bike. Are you sure you don't want me there? Uh, depends on how many um, I'm, I'm not going to be talking too yeah, much. It's because we can only have two people testify during bench trials, and I'm having a penalty to run. If you want to be the other person, I can be the... Hell no. I'm not even listening to Radio How. What's going on? It's so bad right now. You want me to 10 3 then? Who's the other they gave it no, but James, Chicago, no, 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 this is Sergeant on it. Sure, it is. I gotta go. If you guys wanna come to it, let me know. Meet me there, okay? We're leaving now. Alright. Just 311 if you need me. I kicked Marty Banks off of his bike twice after he drove into three cops to pick up his friend. Still clearing up. We can't really spare anyone. Excuse me, excuse me. I kind of like the way it looks like this. Yeah. Why is the 66 so far off? Yeah, sir? from what I know of uh, suspension stuff, uh, if you if you raise it, it's going to drastically affect like uh, the the chance it has to flip as well as the uh, the handle. So if I lower it, then it's going to be better? Uh, typically, yeah. I mean, the only issue is obviously that you're going to get caught on more shit, right? Yep. I knew a guy that was, that was collecting all the uh, Porsches five years ago. Approaching James down. Right. People slowing Parking down. Up, right? Hey, uh, the suspension didn't PBS stick. Well, I ain't the one that put everything on, so. Oh, off. shit. Can, uh, oh, here. Order! Left side, Bob Davis. I mean, it's gonna stop them. I don't, if, if I'm the one giving clearance for that, I say go for it. From the... What are those rims? You don't like my rims? Jesus. Left northbound. I guess you can tell your car out of the, the rest of them. Yep. Oh my god. Nice. That lift. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Hopefully, don't tip over, Lenny. Alright. Take it easy. Yeah. Get the ticket. <laughs> so I'm gonna go for PBS on this vehicle. If their vans start breaking or coming in on us and starting to ram us, we'll just. You are off. so getting dab for this. Hey, firm, now northbound Elgin. Nicole What's life lived without a couple of mobile, doing left, actual police work points? There you go. But yeah, I use the Forbidden Jutsu, Declan. Which one? The Bike Kicks Slowing Jutsu. Down. Oh, God. <laughs> push him, push him, push him. He's separate from the rest. How about? All the vents seem to break off right northbound. Calais, uh, secondary ticket. Yay. Northbound Calais, right eastbound, but the white garage. Right Is it stuck at first for you? No, it's fine. I'm interested to see if you can, uh, like what it what it feels like turning. It feels kind of the same. Go to um that jump in Vinewood. No, what's the loop? Uh, Meteor, Vinewood, and Spanish. This is the loop. The turn right here. Okay, now just go, go up to Vinewood Boulevard, and then just keep making uh, rights over and over and over. Try to maintain speed, basically. Really, really good drivers will sometimes go here and just make circles and just gain distance on you from like making the circles better, basically. And I just want to see if uh, how it turns doing this. Missed by two. Is this okay? And, and here's the other question: Have you confirmed this actually lets you drive over stuff better? Not yet. That's why I got it. Okay, let's try it. Because I don't. If it's not affecting your turning, it might 
just be cosmetic, you know what I mean? And it might not actually uh, be lifted, if that makes sense. There might be, like, undercarriage that exists still. I don't know. I'm trying to think of something you could drive over that you couldn't before. You know that one, uh, that one house in, uh, Vinewood with, like, the stairs that you jump over the wall with? Okay. I don't know which backyard that is. I mean, there's a bunch. I, I don't know which one you're talking about. It, it's like a small white staircase, and then you jump over the wall in the backyard, and then you go into the hill behind the backyard. Yeah, I think I'd have to see it. That still sounds like uh, a bunch of houses. fine to me. I think it's above this. I'm not 100% with his house is. If Bones is on duty, I could, I could ask him. It's like kind of like a little gate that you push open. To go into the driveway or to leave? To uh, go into the backyard. Do I know what you're talking about now? Probably. Are you talking about where you go through like the, like a secondary sidewalk into like the yard and then you kind of like dip back out on the street really quickly? No, the- I think of a different one. The purpose is to jump onto the hills behind the house. Oh uh, no, I don't know that one. Well, I do, but I don't know. I, visually, I need to see it. Uh. I think maybe up here. Yeah, right here. This one. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretty sure I couldn't take that jump before. I mean, pretty sweet. How much did it cost you to lift this? Uh, 500. Well, minus 1,000. Why? Because <laughs> they're gonna make you change. No. They can't make us change it if we're not in the city and they don't see us. As soon as Seraxu <laughs> sees this thing, <laughs> back to Moose, please. Too small for this go. Not good, Declan. 
Hey. <laughs> I'm gonna get out so it's easier. Stop, stop, stop. <laughs> you're gonna have to send it over back up you're gonna have to send it over this so you just do it at speed there you go uh... oh yeah it's also gonna make this thing turtle a lot i think on your whereabouts and all that, but okay. Where the wheels attached to? A bar? <laughs> Duh. give you permission to correct that chatter sorry chatter bunny amber toilet rim liquor nen juju thanks for subbing see yo thanks for subbing dude happy tie day oh, happy tie day bro It's tidy, tidy. So what's uh, been going on so far? So we got to do it. I got involved in a laundromat. I hopped on a uh, bike anticipating some uh, bike chicanery. Bike chicanery did happen. However, I was, uh, you know, my bike tops out at about 99. 90, if I'm being generous, more about like 91-ish. 99 is that, is that with like shifting your weight and doing wheelies yes well you can't really you can shift your weight but you can't do wheelies at high speeds on that thing all right um and i i ended up catching up to mcnulty and leon cassidy in front of senior buns there's a guy running around trying to evade capture i just kind of uh i kept overwatch on the bike uh, lo and behold, a bike pulls up into between all three of us and tries to uh, let the guy on. So I wait for the guy on, and then I kick the bike, and then they both fall off. <laughs> and then they try to handcuff him. Uh, they slip out naturally, and then they hop back on the bike. Then I kick the bike again, and then they fell off. And then they got handcuffed again. And, yeah. then, and then they got back one of them got back on the bike I think one of them was handcuffed and then uh, the guy kept trying to get back on the bike but someone kept tasing him and he kept falling off <laughs> and then he got arrested time spiral no jutsu what's that no, that's just like uh, you know like Groundhog's Day yeah. Got yeah, my Chatterino crash. Over and over. Hello, what's up? I'm back. That was weird. Why not just leave that guy behind? Why go back with a bike? The guy had a gun on him too, his personal gun. He had a weapons license. <laughs> but he was, uh, he was he, never leave a man behind. He was a uh, he was at the original scene and he was in the same outfit. He came back on a stolen bike and he had a gun on him. 
So naturally, he got a complex of kidnapping, and his weapon license had to be revoked. Nice. Wait, he was on the original scene? Yeah, and then he got away. What a dummy. Well, it was Marty Banks. He got picked up in his own personal car, too, which ended up getting caught as well. <laughs> yeah. But after he got he got away in that, uh, I guess he got a bike somehow? I don't know. I missed a lot of it because, once again, I was on the bike that goes 90 miles an hour, so I was just kind of behind everyone the whole time. <laughs> that thing sucks. I don't think it has a turbo in it, though, so it might suck less if it had one. Negative. Uh, it's just a weird guy walked up to me at the gas pumps and started groaning at me. I wonder at what point I should get an engine replacement. Uh, I don't know. Change the mechanics, guys. So the last 37 up here was like 30 minutes ago. Yep. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Self serve. Gasoline, no jutsu. Computer the Geek and Guido Scum, thanks for subbing, dude. G W E E D O, Bad Micro, uh, Nukes in Canada, thanks for subbing. Wow, cool. Carnage Motor Shop. <laughs> With a K. It's got oh, yeah, I talked to that guy the other day. Uh... It's in the scrapyard, like right uh, in between the U-Tool and the entrance to Sandy. He had a bunch of signs up everywhere. It didn't. It didn't really look like very official, but you know, he had like signs everywhere. So I don't know. It was that guy, by the way, that you ran over on the motorcycle. Remember the ginger guy? Uh... It was a few days ago. We were driving southbound on the freeway. Oh right, yeah, he... and you just ran over this dude. Hey, fucking drove into oncoming traffic, man. Yeah. Yeah, that guy. There's Siraxu. Operation Avoid Captain Slacks. Go. Wait. Nice lift, thanks, bro. <laughs> oh, uh, what was that right there? That little black car that was parked? I want to see who that comes back to. Because the other day I saw someone hanging out at that house. Ian, Ian Newfounder. Newfounder. Working good. <laughs> I gotta call Cordwood and get his own right. statement. Six people down in Senior Buns. Six people down in Senior Buns. Oh, something just guns. happened here. Yo, he's literally on top of us. What the fuck? Oh no. It's okay, my car can walk it's, now. It's literally right here, like at this gas station. What's it? What's a habanero? It's the little shitty black SUV. The one that the Ian Newfounder would? Could be. I think it's a little bit bigger, but it could be. I'm, I'm not remembering 100%. Southeast. Anyway. 
he smoking around Sydney Mountain? It was not the it was not the Ian Newfounder one, different plate. Habanero's a little bit bigger. It's like I wish I remember the name of this Lexus so that I could impart to you what exactly it looks like. I don't know cars. I'll, 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 I'll know it when I see it. Uh, run that right there, that gray one back there. I just want to see what kind of car it is. I don't think this is Habanero, but I want to double check. Yeah, that's, that's, not, that's not a Habanero. Target eliminated. I think I just saw something turning that could have been back in uh, Sandy proper. It was turning left going north or south, like towards us, but a couple streets down. Another spot to check. Um, Seven six code six. Seven four one seven six. Uh, call came in from Zancuda with Marina. Be on the lookout for a black and color habanero plate ending nine one four. Hey firm. What's seven six? Uh, how do I set up a dash cam for you? Uh, just uh, hop into your vehicle onto your bike and then just click the use button on top of the dash cam. And then just input your call sign, your uh, your name, and then if you're in a special vehicle, put your vehicle name in as well. Uh. That uh. Okay, dispatch. Any available unit in the area prison? We're gonna That call was literally uh, right there. Code warden's kidnapped. We It happened about 45 seconds prior to when the call came out, so we must have been driving around the area. Dispatch for 176, my uh, dash cam should be able to let me know if it's working. Oh, what's that vehicle parked there? You see that? Turn right, turn right. No, no, no. Behind you. It's in the bushes over here. To your right, behind these electrical things. Oh, it's just a buggy. It's a June buggy. No moon shining, dude. Okay, units responding to this 911. Bro, car man's been kidnapped in a black and color pickup truck. Units be on the lookout. I should have charged my mouse last night. Freak. Okay, dispatch. Anyone really on the LS or the North Freeway? Uh, we're getting not what's coming in from Karma, just supposedly kidnapped. We get a unit to respond, please. 176. 176, welcome here, right? 36 I'm going to see if I can contact him by phone. Uh, they want us on channel 2 to go to the bench, as he's just uh, uh, radioed in. Dispatch for 176, I actually need to attend that bench trial. 141, report 1, 76, please, call. 7 1 He wants you on channel 2. Yeah, so, uh, what up, senior officer? Hey, boy, I need you down here at the courthouse. We got, uh, the bench trial taking place. Uh, we're not gonna have Cassidy, it's gonna be too mixed up to get the statements. Can you make your way down here, or are you occupied right now? Oh uh, yeah, I can make my way down here if you'd like, sir. Alright, perfect. Making my way downtown. So it's gonna be me and uh, McNulty? The four. Is, is, uh, is he's gonna be the one questioning us? 
Yeah? What about, you want, uh, bring Declan down here too, we can have persecution. Uh, Declan is with me. Yeah, bring him down here. We can do the line of questioning, me and him, I want to see how he handles it in court. I haven't seen you guys in court yet. Uh, we, we went one time for, uh, getting the mayor's wife on negligent driving and we ended up getting a felony or... But we, uh, we accepted a deferment program out of the great, gracious mercy of our heart. I see, okay. I thought y'all would grill the make for it. I didn't know you had the heart, Lenny. Well, uh, I'm gonna be honest. I am not good at court. It was mostly Declan. <laughs> and this is how we learn. How long do you guys need to get here? Uh, we'll be there in about two minutes, sir. Probably. I can't wait to use Objection Baka again. It seems like uh, someone named Murphy Bronze, the judge. All right. Yeah, I got all my objections. Liar, didn't ask, Baca. <laughs> what else you got? Those were the highlights. I gotta remember what other ones worked well. I'm just okay, gonna can, uh, as to go I get his phone from the mission rope. The judge really liked Baca, though. Tonight, sir. Uh, for 133, do you want uh, to take uh, Marty Banks back so he can get his phone? He's requesting it so he can get in contact with the witness. 177 MPH now. It's only over those bumps. Isn't he just gonna call his the top to speed's still out? the same? It's negative, like, it's negative. Like one the judge four is telling us to go something. get him his phone so he can call the witness that he's calling down here. Everyone's car goes faster than that. Uh, every, everyone's car goes faster when going out over that stretch of land because of the way that the road is. It's like bumpy. A little bumpy. Bumpy equals faster. <laughs> Leading Jutsu. <laughs> Did foil hat. No, our senior officer's there. Two of them will be there. <laughs> they will tell us no, dude. Who, who's the person that you guys were trying to contact? Reporting for duty! Vincent, Vincent. Let me see if I can find Vincent him. Vincent Malone. Yeah, he's, um, I have uh, seen a bunch of employees tracking his number and getting in contact with him for us. Okay, perfect. Uh, yes, All right, how you boys doing? Okay. Doing uh, good, uh, sir. Uh, Officer Hall is going to be testifying now, too, since he's here. Yes, you're welcome. Report. Cool. And hey, we're going to have... Hey. McNulty and we're going to have Lenny over here. They're going to be testifying. Myself and Declan will be asking questions of persecution. All yeah, right. send it. Excellent. Uh, just be advised, there was a man. Big It's going to sound crazy, okay? A man licking piss off of your cop car. Who's? Uh, Hello, McNulty. They do know it's here, uh, so I, I am worried that it is going to get stolen. Extra notebook. Like Who the fuck is pissing on my... Wait. I'm, Did you not park I'm your car, sir? <laughs> well, no, I had the 95 with this, but... You want me to go park it for you, sir? All right, it's a personal. I'll go deal with it. Uh, Keep an eye on him for me, okay? Okay. All right, thank you. I, now, you wanna, I gotta go park one. my vehicle real quick. Somebody's pissing Someone on me. me. <laughs> Someone gave me this hood Bible, so you can use the other pages. Go You're honorable, Mr. Braun. That that uh, robe looks fucking amazing, sir. Doesn't it? It's, uh, it's pretty good, huh? <laughs> I can put on a, a, a creepy mask and it's like a secret society party. Yep. Kind of look too. From Hitman. Check this <laughs> Check this out. Yeah. Yeah, that's fucking cool. <laughs> Anyways. Yeah, and it's, uh, it's actually pretty comfortable. Yeah, I bet it is. I wish I could wear... Uh... Freedom of movement. Yeah, but they used to let us wear short sleeve shirts back on the force back in the day. No longer. <laughs> so I understand. In shorts, too. Yeah, I mean, especially when you're out there trying to take people down, you gotta be able to gotta be able to have ease of movement. Yeah, you and know, the, be flexible. We live in fucking San Andreas too, man. It's fucking hot. It's like a hundred degrees all the time. 
Fuck, son. The clan, son. Hey! Hey. Oh. Shaban Chan, I didn't even notice you. Oh, hello, Sensei Hulk. His number? No, I have not so you, you, you dare address time. her as, as Ch Chan, you baka. She's my pupil. All right. Um, <laughs> Damn it. Well, I'm going to have to. I'm going to have you to. You win again. Your, uh, uh, One day, it will be my turn. Essential this witness is. Uh, well, Marty. I hate losing. I mean, <laughs> he was the one. I mean, he's on scene. He was kidnapped. He's our. Star boy. Hmm. You know, like that one song by Eminem? Motherfucking star boy. You know? Venom. That was just <laughs> a weekend. No, I think it's Friday. Now go get him. No, no. The, the song. It's the weekend. That's not Eminem. What? Starboy? What? From Guardians of the Galaxy? Yeah. He goes, Venom, yeah. Venom, Venom. Yeah, it's the Starboy from Guardians of the Galaxy. Venom. Oh, like remix Excited something? for the shitlord yeah, trial. Know. I don't know how much we're going to be able to shitlord. I'm not big in a rock and roll. Two of our senior officers are going to be here, uh, so. All right, so. This witness can't make it. This witness can't make it. So we'll have to figure out what to do about that. Yeah, I got his number disease, no answer, so I presume he's fucking... Oh, is our good. Mormon sister his attorney? Uh, no, he's oh. self-representing. We're talking about his casino? All right, well, it's not time to talk about his casino. Damn. Why are we praying? I don't understand. I'm Catholic, so... We're channeling our cheese, sir. Oh. No. You sure you aren't trying to atone for your sins? What sin, sir? I am I am an operating thetan. You've never sinned in your life. Don't you have sex with your sister? How is that oh. a sin? Oh. Huh? Whoa. Hey, your people oh. did it for hundreds of years before. Whoa, you people? Oh. 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 I said oh. your people. Your oh. people. Hey, hey, why do you think that red hair oh, stuck what? around? <laughs> All right, uh... No. Can we calm it down over there for we just one second? Better, better uh, wall Mr. Floor. Banks, uh, your witness Mommy, uh, is unavailable the... and unreachable. So, okay. at this point, they're not coming today, uh, whether we want them here or or not. So, what what do you what do you want to do? Um. Well, what are my options? I believe I have nothing else to proceed. I mean, being that you're here representing yourself. Uh, I'm gonna give you the option, even though usually a bench trial is pretty much a commitment on your part once invoked. Uh, I, I will give you the option to basically plead not guilty and appeal this later with an attorney and get your witness if you'd rather do that. Uh, otherwise, oh. if you still want the bench trial, we are proceeding it's without your alone. witness. And again, you can appeal this oh, later. Oh shit, I got him! Whatever whatever happens without your witness. Uh, the witness is happens. coming. It sounds like Middle the got him, coming. sir. Okay, all right. That Take has... two. I'm ignoring the goddess. That's coming. my countryman. Check that. Where's clothing? No. But I'm not even, I'm not even Am I blind? Freaky fucking costume. Why are you doing this? Mr. Cock gave me an L. You literally hovered it? Everything back, man. Dude, I'm uh, freaking has blind. Has anyone seen Sebastian Birch around lately? I saw Sebastian around last Birch? night. He he was the lawyer for uh, Siobhan Chan's case like a week ago. And he <laughs> sucked. Yeah, I'm trying to set him up on a date right now. Where's the tinfoil hat? I think it's toward the end. Uh, Your Honor, I don't need the witness anymore. I'm going to keep it a buck. I think oh, McNulty just got him, though. Yeah, McNulty just got him. Oh, well, I don't need him. Nice. Tell that guy to fuck off. <laughs> Tell All him right, he well, wasted his time. 
In that case, we'll just wait for McNulty to get back and we'll get started. Now my vest is gone? Yeah, we'll fix it eventually. Hold on. Hey, Your Honor, we have a new problem. <laughs> It's okay, uh, uh, what, Mr. Banks doesn't want the problem? witness. Oh, he doesn't want the witness. Hey, Ferb. What's the problem, though? Uh, he has a slight concussion. Probably. All right. A slight, concussion. A slight concussion, he said. All right, well, Mr. Banks does not want to call the witness, so we're not going to call the witness. Bye-bye. He says... Peace out. Dead ass. And hung dead up. ass. Alright, well, dead ass, we're gonna get this thing started here. Um Alright, we got uh the people v Marty Banks, uh, who is looking at five charges, one of joyriding, one of tampering with a vehicle, one of robbery, uh, one of felony obstruction of justice, and accomplice. Uh, to kidnapping one times. Uh, he's looking at a total of 123 minutes in Bolingbrook and a $5,010 yeah. fine. Minutes. How does the uh, defendant plead to the following charges? Um, all of them not guilty, Your Honor. All of them not guilty. Thank you. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and blanket swear in. Everybody uh, is going to be testifying at this bench trial now for expediency of time. Uh, so everyone who's going to testify, please raise your left hand to be sworn in. All right. Do you swear and affirm the testimony you're going to give in court today? Be the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. So help you coil. I do. Amen. I do. All right. Perfect. Okay. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and just... Uh, I'm going to allow each side to give uh, an opening of sorts. We won't be doing closing, so I'll, I'll just allow each side to present their narrative and then uh, cross-examination and, and the like bench trial style. So uh, prosecution, why don't you give, uh, why don't you have your primary or who will be speaking for you give your version of events? <clears throat> yeah, don't mind. Ladies and gentlemen of the courts, I, Officer Z, Salted Badge 116 today. We have a case. Marty Banks is involvement in a robbery that took place over at the laundromat. Your Honor, ladies and gentlemen of the court, Marty Banks, the same exact outfit that he was wearing right there to my right, was there, documented in evidence at the laundromat where the robbery took place. Many officers there, outlined in their statements in evidence, show that Mr. Banks was there, seen entering the vehicle that took off. The gray Lampadati that was later apprehended as well. Himself, along with two other individuals, were at the robbery that took place. He fled. The vehicle eventually flipped over by Legion Square, where he was picked up by a black and colored sultan that fled. He's looking at the robbery charge. He's looking at the kidnapping as there was an individual that was taken there against their will and was held there against their will as a bargaining token to get out in exchange for free passage to their vehicle. We successfully, I might add, got the individual back into our custody. So whether this is a plain and simple case, a robbery, an individual was caught, and we are here at day in court. That is all for the opening statement. Okay. Mr. Banks. Hello, Your Honor. What's the Banks um, defense? Unfortunately, uh, Aziz is wrong here. No disrespect to Aziz. No disrespect to the LSPD. Damn. Case closed. <laughs> but this is not a plain and simple case. Oh. Unfortunately, the LSPD today has been kerfuffled. And hopefully, as the victim, as well as the representation of myself, I can clearly articulate that and help lay out the plan that was executed by one Vincent Malone and one suspect that is still walking today, sir. Is he now, on my side, sir, 
on my side, I was at Senior Buns ordering food. I have received this food. And as soon as I walked out, one Vincent Malone and one individual masked and dressed the same way I was. Uh, the mask was a, a rat mask, which we'll get into. Uh, and he, he held a knife to my neck and took my sultan. <gasps> now, at that point, I was lost. I was upset and I was, I was willowing in my sorrows, your honor. And for about 20 to 30 minutes, I didn't know what was next. And it and at that point, after the 30 minutes or so, M Mr. Vincent Malone came to me and gave me a deal. And then that's why he deal, didn't want him here. <laughs> the plan was for me to dress up how he wanted his accomplice to look at his little uh, 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 extravaganza over at the laundromat. And in exchange, once I picked up his friend and moved on along my way, I would be receiving my vehicle. Anks no harm, no foul. Something. Everyone would live to see another day. The Sultan, the baby Sultan who was given to me by Oscar Buster, God rest his soul. I wanted it back, Your Honor. So if I am mistaken for listening to this man's uh, commands, I apologize. But Your Honor, this is not a plain and simple case. This is absolutely not. And throughout the court case, I will hopefully be able to represent and show you why the PD got it all fucking wrong. Thank you. <laughs> Objection, Lang Baca. <laughs> all right. Objection, overruled. Uh, the <laughs> defendant I will be entering onto the record is employing a uh, a defense of coercion. Um, am I correct in saying that you are? You are saying you did these things, some of them at least under duress, Mr. Banks? That's right, Your Honor. Um, and when it comes to the uh, the whole laundromat thing, I was not part of this in any situation, Your Honor, and I and I am willing to prove this, no problem. Okay. All right. Um, all right. Opening statements are entered. Let's uh, let's get into the uh, the testimony of the witnesses and uh, the questioning. Uh, who's going to be uh, testifying? Uh, about the situation first. Uh, your you Honor, want... we would like to call see the officer McNulty to the stand first. All right, McNulty, Hello. you may, may step up onto the witness stand. And uh, Sorry if I whenever sound you a are ready. Drained. I, uh, it's, it's Irish weekend and I am... Oh, happy, happy Irish weekend. Must be nice. Sorry, could you, I'm sorry, could you speak up for the court? You said it's Irish Day and you are what? <clears throat> Irish. <laughs> okay, so um, that's it. It's Irish Day and you are Irish, so that's why you're no, apologizing. It's, it's Irish weekend, so I'm sorry if I sound a bit drained. Oh, uh, so, okay, okay. All right, perfect. Why are you badgering my witness? I'm not badgering. Uh, yeah, I'm Mr. Sorry. Banks, it is not, it's not your turn yet. Not Groundhog Day. Witness. No problem. Sorry, Your Honor. Our prosecution, whenever you're uh, ready to question this witness, you right. can proceed. The further we'll be able to get a narrative testimony from Officer McNulty. Uh, yeah, brief one. All right, brief McNulty. one. Okay, that was what happened. Okay, I uh, responded to a ninety, which is a uh, robbery in progress of a uh, laundromat there on the south side. Arrived on scene, there was a um, like a creamish. In color Lampadati parked out the front, cream like brownish, coffeeish. Um, three suspects inside, one wearing a maid outfit, um, speaking in a high pitched tone, uh, identified as one Tony Corleone. Wait, my father? Yes, yes, your father. <laughs> my dad was in a maid outfit? Yeah, and hey. respectfully, let me tell you. You look kind of good. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> what? Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> he had me pausing. Let me tell you. Oof. He said. Uh, he, he said um, he'd buy me some Valorant skins. Jeez. Said he wanted me to ERP with him in Discord. <laughs> oh god! Oh, look what you've done to my. Oh my lord! I want that on record, by the way. Tony Corleone asked me to ERP with him on Discord. Is that okay, Your Honor? Um, I'll allow it. Awesome. Um. It's not adoption fraud. That's his actual. Uh, son. Secondary sub. Uh, second one. Uh, brown pants, white top, 
uh, later identified as uh, something Italian, uh, Vittorio Dicenzo. And then a third wearing a gray, black checkered top, rat mask, black mask, uh, black pants with white patterns. Uh, exactly what Mr. Banks is wearing, minus the rat mask, which we caught him in. Um, the person with the maid outfit, Tony Corleone, was holding the hostage up, which was a one Vincent Malone. Jeez. While... Hmm. <clears throat> Sorry. Sorry, you had to find um, out this way, AJ. While <laughs> it's okay. rat mask and uh, brown pants um, went about breaking into the machines in the back, uh, as seen uh, in one of the pictures taken by Mr. Aziz. Um, the safe in the back room was also open during this time. Um, uh, I began hostage negotiations, speaking with one Tony Corleone. Um... They wanted free passage, no uh, spikes upon exits, which was granted. Uh, they were allowed access to the Lampadati and fled. At this time, I spoke to one um, Vincent Malone, who was the hostage in that, with, uh, who had a knife to his neck the entire time. Um, yeah, yeah, this this is cool. stated that he was at Senior Buns, about to start his job. Uh, he hopped onto a scooter when a car pulled up. Um, he was held at night point, thrown to the car, circled around the laundromat a few times before brought in, and then we arrived on scene. Uh, spoke to him, then I cleared the laundromat out. Uh, safe in the back was coping up to, as I mentioned. Um, once the hostage was safe, I brought Mr. Malone to Senior Buns and rejoined the pursuit. Uh, ran parallel before learning that the vehicle was flipped uh, outside Legion Square, in which case... Uh, suspects fled while Rat Mask remained um, I guess I could charge my inside the vehicle. Uh, in the, and at that time, the Black Sultan pulled up that came back to a one Marty Banks, who was present here today. Um, who was, and the driver was ID as one Larry Knox fled uh, in an attempt to drive in a straight line up the Los Santos Freeway, unknown that I was in a V-Star and kept up with him no problem. Um, at this point, they, uh, the pursuit led to the casino where they drove around the dirt track. Uh, Rat Mask jumped onto a, hopped over a wall onto a bike, uh, driven by an individual wearing a green trench coat and a mask. Um, Rat Mask got onto the back, fled, and they were lost. And at that point, uh, Leon Cassidy was chasing the Black Sultan which had broken down on Del Perro Freeway. Driver got out on foot. Driver was, again, ID'd as one Larry Knox. Um, at one point, he was tased a couple times, was screaming on the phone to, please come pick him up. Please come pick him up. Um, at that point, a white superbike arrives on scene. Rat mask, exact same outfit as Marty is wearing. Um, in which point, I tased the driver off, attempted to get him into tough cuffs. This happened a couple of times. I did tase him multiple times. Uh, finally got him into custody. Brought him into the original scene. Larry Knox was placed into custody. Um, uh, I found uh, once fristing, fristing down, patted him down, went through items, found uh, a total of 3,261 laundry coins. Um, That's a lot. As well as registered firearm, a hunting rifle to his person. Um, uh, got a medical, got the taser pongs removed. Uh, while reading him his rights down MRPD, he wanted to say he wanted a bench trial, and we are here. He forgot some details. All right. All right. Uh, questions. Prosecution. Okay. Senior Officer McNulty, when Hello. you arrived on scene at the laundromat in the south side, you said you saw a vehicle there, the Lampadazi, three mm -hmm. color, and three suspects with one hostage inside, correct? Correct. Is the outfit matching one of the suspects there match the outfit that Mr. Marty Banks is wearing today? Correct. All right. While you were making negotiations, did you see individuals going in and out of the back of the laundromat? Correct. By the back room, correct? Correct. Who did you see going in and out of the back rooms? Uh, brown pants or rat mask? Either of the ones. Okay. Once the pursuit ensued, you stayed back, correct? Correct. You received a hostage statement from one 
Uh, Vincent, correct? Yes, Vincent Malone, correct. Okay. Were you able to clear the inside to make sure nobody else was inside the yes. laundromat? Yeah, Opal, Opal Price and I. Um, Super leading. Uh, uh, inside. Um, no one was present. Uh, uh, I think he's allowed Mr. to Malone ask that because it's narrative testimony. Crime, I don't know. You know. Coins, money, cash. Uh, nothing was on his person. Okay. Let's move forward a little bit in your statement, okay? I want to focus on when you attached to the pursuit and the vehicle was flipped over. Did you yes, arrive that, on scene? Yeah, I was I was uh, on scene. I uh, was flipped, got there, and arrived on scene, yes. Did you witness the individual in the rat mask enter another vehicle? Yes, a black sultan that came back to a one Marty Banks. Came back to Marty Banks. And the same individual that you claim was in the rat mask is one Marty Banks, correct? Correct. All right. Now, when you search Mr. Banks, you claimed you found laundry coins on him as well and a fireworm. Did you find anything else of notice? Uh, lock picks on his uh, possession, as well as I a see. radio. Um, when is Lenny getting a 23 and me to, only to discover his heritage is 13% Mexican? <laughs> okay. And did you work on any impounding of any vehicles? Objection. Me Objection. Relevance. Well, it is relevant as vehicles were impounded and documented. As but what does that have to do with? What does that have to do with me and 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 me? Uh, you know, object objecting the fact that I was even there in the first place. What is? I what believe is you are looking at uh, Mr. Banks. You're looking at one count of tampering with a vehicle. I'm overruling the objection. So, mm -hmm. okay, uh, that is part of the charges you're facing today. No problem. Right. So uh, repeat the go ahead. Repeat the question. Did you document or impound any of the said vehicles utilized in the crimes today? I did not document any of the vehicles, no. Okay. Do you know if any of the vehicles did have signs of tampering? Uh, yes, the white bike that Marty Banks was found on. All right. Just one moment. I wonder what he's going to ask me. Have questions? Declan? Hi. But I think uh, it's better just to ask Marty later. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. I'm good with everything here. Yeah, I'm good. All right, Your Honor, I do not have any further questions for the witness today. Okay, uh, Mr. Banks, uh, do you have questions for this witness? Yes, sir. Yes, sir, I do. All right. Uh, Hi, Marty. Hello, uh, Officer McNulty. Um, so, obviously, you documented my possessions that's correct that is correct now could you list the things that you uh found like the uh, highlighted not not necessarily bandages but things that you would identify as relevant to the case um, <laughs> uh crowbar used to break into the potentially open up the laundry things and the mm. 3261 coins found in your possession as okay. well as the lock pick on your possession Lock you to break in and tamper with a super bike, which you were found on. Now, there was also a firearm um, in my positions, correct? Correct. Was there a firearm used inside of the laundromat? Negative. Okay. That's interesting. And you said that there were that laundry coins on my <laughs> possession, right? Yes. 3,261. Now, could you explain to me how you identify these as laundry coins? Uh, small change coins now commonly used and found across multiple scenes uh, when we catch people from these laundromats exact same coins usually in large amounts okay okay sure sure I'm not sure he's arguing mechanics guys hang on he's and trying the, to he's uh, trying radio to radio that I was on what was it again objection or, or... asked and answered your honor I never asked this Sean thinks there's something. And you never asked it either. He just I said mean, it. You did. Nah. Uh, overruled. He could have just answered. It's in evidence. Just uh, let's keep this rolling. What's the uh, frequency? Uh, four oh four point one, I believe. That's why we're going to keep us going. Are you the he can't, are you though. the officer that documented uh, Larry Knox's radio? The water six for seven. Negative. Okay. Um, and Irish weekend, right? <laughs> what? 
it's Irish weekend, you said? Ob objection, Your Honor. Out of scope. Uh, Your Honor, uh, Your Honor, uh, if it's Irish weekend, I, I know plenty of Irish people. I just want to make sure that uh, this officer here is uh, mentally ready to complete his job <laughs> and be, uh, you know, an actual witness in this case, because he could be drunk. We don't know. I know multiple people that celebrate Irish weekend by being drunk. Are as you fuck. profiling me, Marty? <laughs> No, all right, it's all just right. a common celebration, gonna, sir. That's I'm not gonna general... general... Alright, alright. Order in the court. Order in the <laughs> court. I'm going to make a general ruling right now that uh, whatever he said before he sat down in the chair about, uh, you know, small talk and whatnot, that's off the record. It's got nothing to do with this line of questioning. So. Okay. All it's right. out of scope. Just... Okay. Uh, my last question. Maybe my last question. Officer McNulty, are you drunk right now? <laughs> no, I am not drunk. Okay. Okay. And you said in your statement that at one point the individual in the rat mask was lost. Is that correct? Yes. And how long would you say until the rat mask was uh, seen again in the situation in, in its entirety? Uh, but maybe five maybe minutes. five minutes or so. Yep. Five minutes or so. So no, absolutely no sight, zero sight of the individual in the rat mask for five whole minutes. They were, I spotted them when they were leaving and a one. Wait, so this guy got away and he didn't ditch the coins? What a buck. Uh, Officer he Maple he spotted them once more the around coin, Mirror Park or, uh, playing again. The they were lost around San Andreas. Or changed clothes? Yeah. Okay. Now, how long does it take you to change your clothes? We actually spotted that white bike. If you were in a big oh, rock. was on it. I feel like there's an objection for this one. How long would it take me to change my clothes? Oh, yeah. Objection relevance. All right. I can rephrase. No problem. Withdrawn? Okay. Try again. In your experience, officer, how fast have you seen a criminal be able to change their clothes in, in a situation and come back to a, come back to a scene? I in have no experience. clue because I don't watch people get changed. Right. Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> no problem. No problem. No further questions. Thank you, Mr. M McNulty. No problem, Shmarty. All right, All right McDul McNulty, you can uh, you can stand down. Hey, uh, hey, you've been a great crowd. You've been a great crowd, everybody. Yeah. All right. Okay. Uh, who's up? Who's up next? A weird question. But oh, we'd like to call one officer, Lenny Hawk. to stand. Okay. All right. Very well, Lenny Hawk. Don't throw on. this. To the witness stand. So Bitch, I'll throw if I want. <laughs> tell, let your story be told. Yeah, he is. Yeah. Just trying to find the perfect angle to sit down uh, at, guys. Uh, <laughs> hey, you know, everybody has, has some trouble with that one. I'm just going to stay. You wouldn't be the first. I'm just going to stay. That's fine. <laughs> it's good for your back. Uh, Your Honor, we'd like to have another narrative testimony from one Lenny Hawk, please. Uh, yeah. Go ahead. Uh, so I, I pulled up to the laundromat. Got a, I was riding the bike. The the shitty PD bike. Uh, got a, got a brief glimpse of everyone inside. You know, my description matches that of uh, Officer McNulty's and everyone else's. Uh, I arrived pretty much... Uh, almost immediately before the pursuit began, I uh, ran parallel because the shitty PD bike, uh, you know, and anticipating some sort of bike interference as well, I wanted to see how effective it would be. Uh, I, <laughs> I followed behind at a very snail-like pace until I managed to catch up to the uh, the original flipped vehicle at Legion Square. Um. I, I provided mobile oversight, uh, transitioning between both foot chases, one with uh, t uh, Tony Corleone in his very attractive maid outfit and uh, uh, another one near the uh, the front of Legion Square. Eventually, um, the guy driving Marty Banks's personal vehicle, I, I forget the actual uh, make of the vehicle. It's like a, it's like a, it looks kind of like a Sultan or some shit. I don't know. <clears throat> Um, eventually I rolled back around to see, uh, Rat Mask Chan hop into the, the passenger seat, take off, 
At that point, uh, I am a non-factor the entire pursuit because they went to the highway and my bike, once again, piece of shit. So I just kind of hovered around the area and attempted to make myself useful. I actually was headed toward the the casino because I know there's some uh, some silly, uh, some goofy little guy tricks back there that could happen on the dirt track. So I was going to try to uh, be parallel there. Uh, however, before I could get there, the white bike uh, pulled up and rescued the guy, the rat mask guy, and then they took off uh, toward Mirror Park where I was lost, and then uh, I tried to make myself useful elsewhere. Very difficult to do. Whisper, Bacchus. <clears throat> Um, and eventually I joined uh, Leon Cassidy and McNulty, McNulty uh, basically right in front of uh, White Garage uh, on the Senior Bun side. And they were chasing a guy that was uh, later identified as uh, Larry Knox on foot, the two of them. Eventually, White Bike pulls up again. Rat Mask Chan, later identified as Marty Banks after being apprehended, is on the bike. The original guy that was driving the bike to pick up Marty Banks was no longer there. Uh, according to the other officers and myself, he was wearing the same shit that he was wearing at the laundromat. I, uh, I kind of circled the area. Um, at this point, Larry had not been apprehended yet. He was very elusive. He managed to hop on the bike, so I gave it a good kick on the side and knocked him off. Uh, they, uh, Leon and McNulty attempted to apprehend them, slapped them into cuffs. Uh, he did, or they did. Um, they got, I believe they got Larry first. Uh, I ended up, I think I kicked him off the bike one more time. And then, uh, uh, officers tased Marty, uh, like two more times or some shit. It was a, it was a, it was a silly little situation. And then uh, eventually he got in, uh, slapped into cuffs too, and then that's pretty much, I mean, I documented the stolen bike, and that's it, really. Okay. <clears throat> we got a couple questions for you, okay? Do you sir? All right, great job on this shitty snail bike. You may do with what you can. How fast did it go? Tops out at a uh, whopping 91 miles an hour. Mm -hmm. and, and that's mm -hmm. after a little bit of getting there. <laughs> okay. Now I'm just going to ask you a couple of questions. Yeah, 91 miles per hour. Uh, when you guys, when you attached to the pursuits that were running on for it, you said it was one Tony Corleone and one uh, DeCenzo, correct? The individual with the brown pants, white shirt. Yes. You witnessed the individual with the rat mask and the checker shirt. Ma Yes. Leading. What's your objection? Leading, Your Honor. I'll rephrase it. Okay. Uh, good. Sustain. Who was the individual you witnessed enter the black and color sports vehicle that you claim arrived on? Objection, scene? leading. Well, I already answered that too. It's true. <laughs> right. Let me ask you this. You documented the motorcycle? Yes, sir. Did it have signs of tampering? Yes, sir. Objection, leading. Um, I rebuttal to mm, that. Is it over? Not... Okay. Oh, I'm I'm gonna overrule that. I don't I don't feel that's leading. Okay. So just for clarity's sakes, there were signs of tampering. Yes. Yes, sir. No, I... very good. no that that was leading. That was leading. Okay. <laughs> Apologies on that one. I'm just clarified for. I didn't hear his answer from you. How long did you lose visual on the uh, individual with the motorcycle until they re-arrived to the scene? Objection hearsay. It's clear. It's clear in. Uh, it's clear in this officer's uh, statement. He he does not have enough information uh, to answer that question in any capacity. All right. Let me hear the question again. How long did we lose visual on them until they arrived back on scene? Your Honor, if you read his statement, if you read his statement, he has next to nothing in here. He barely pulled up to the scene. He circled around, wasn't able to do anything. He already said that his bike goes at 91 miles per hour. I don't imagine any vehicle that was used in this chase was going under 90 miles per hour in, unless it was a turn. Uh, I don't think I don't think uh, Officer Hawk here uh, can answer that question. Uh, rebuttal. Right. Yeah. Yeah, rebuttal is allowed. 
Uh, Lenny's son has ears and is capable of hearing radio communications that instruct him when someone goes but VCB that, and when they reappear. So, that's that's reliant on secondhand right. information. That's not his information, and that right. would no, also no, just no. be hearsay. All right. None, no nonetheless, Mr. Banks. Yeah. Nonetheless, Mr. Banks. Uh, you know, there's many ways that he could know that information as part of a team, and also, if he doesn't know, I'm sure he's perfectly capable of saying, "I'm not aware. Uh, I was not told, or I was not personally present." So, right. Okay. Um, could we have? I think. It, could, sorry. Sorry. Go ahead. No. No. Uh, what? What would you want? I was going to say, could we just have it phrased in a way that it's evident that he is not the one that has this information, and that it was more so relayed to him, and like he was not there in that situation to be able to 100 percent eyewitness accurately uh pick this otherwise i feel like all right you know i think that the witness is capable of making that clear uh by answering the question and okay. you will have the opportunity to uh further inquire about that when you cross-examine him fair enough yes your honor fair enough all right awesome uh i'm overruling the objection uh he can answer that question to the best of his ability uh, for if the, you want to repeat it, yeah, repeat, it, please. How long did you lose visual on a motorcycle before it returned back with the same outfit? So I actually saw that motorcycle hovering around Legion Square, um, like around the uh, the time of the first crash, and the the camo jacket guy was the one driving it at that point. I kind of scared him off, I guess, because he didn't ended up not getting involved until later when he picked up that guy at the. Uh, the the what's it the casino dirt track or whatever uh that I, that would be the first time that i saw the white bike and i wouldn't see it again until it tried to pick up uh uh larry knox in front of senior buns when uh mcnulty and cassidy were chasing him on foot <sighs> i believe declan might have some questions for you Lenny's son. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Why is Naruto heavily overrated? It's overrated because the power level in the show itself is generally pretty low and weak. Honestly, how, how am I supposed to get behind a main character who screams words and then uses like blocks of wood to do his magic? It's lame. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. No further questions. <laughs> Sustained. <laughs> All right. Uh, Mr. Banks, uh, yeah. I believe you had some questions, uh, definitely, for this witness. Yeah. Hey, um, Officer Hawk, you said the first time you saw the bike was over at Legion Square, circling around. Is that correct? Yep. And what was the description you had of that individual? Uh, same one of the guy who picked you up at the casino. I don't know what you're talking about. Could you specifically <laughs> identify um, you know, traits, clothing. Yeah, yeah, like that. yeah. A green jacket, very soft-spoken voice. You said camo pants, no? I didn't say camo pants. I just remember the green okay. jacket. So, are you sure about that? Yes, sir. Okay. You saw a green jacket circling out, circling around in a white bike, right? Yep. And you said soft-spoken voice. Yep. So. During this, uh, during this uh, Legion Square situation, you heard the individual on the bike speaking to you, soft-spoken. Yeah, I, I rolled up to him and I was like, "Hey, what are you doing?" He was like, "Oh, I'm." He was like, "Oh, oh I'm, I'm just out for a ride." Ugh. And I was like, "All right, well, stay, like stay away, stay mm -hmm. away from mm -hmm. the area." Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. And <laughs> did you identify that bike to be the same exact bike as the one that was uh, apprehended at the Senior Buns? I could. I, uh, I still have the plate record. <laughs> okay, so I'm asking, did you or did you not? Uh, no, I suppose not. All right, all right. So the the bike and the individual on the bike at Legion Square is currently not under record. The same bike used and that was found and and taken away at Senior Buns. Correct. Objection. Many, many things in one. <laughs> yes. He said and like five times. Baka. Okay. I can rephrase. It, no problem. Uh, yeah. Break it down. Step by step. Okay. The bike that was taking at Senior Buns is not in evidence as the same bike at Legion Square. Correct? Objection. Not a question. 
<laughs> the end. With drone. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. You can answer the question. Objection was withdrawn. Whoa, what was the question again? <laughs> Why bike no proof? same if have bike same? Do you have proof that the bike at Legion Square that you saw is the same bike at Senior Buns? The one that the same bike that you guys collected? Yeah, I do. It's just uh I kind is of Is it in evidence? No. <laughs> so do you have it? Yeah. So no, the answer is no. Well, right? yeah, no, I do technically right. have it. I just didn't throw it in there. Yeah. Well, it's not in evidence. <laughs> he does have it. it. <laughs> but it's not in evidence. So can yeah. it be used in a court of law in this situation? Well, I, well, I, well, I, 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 what he saw, right? I'm sorry. I, I, I'm sorry. I, 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 am I asking you questions or am I asking the witness? Well, I'm the person. All right, all right. So I'm going to answer on when you're okay, right. Order, I'm, order in the court. Order in the court. Let's, uh, let's get a, let's, let's get a decision on this. Uh, I, I, I want to know why it's not in evidence if we're talking about it. I didn't have time to uh, confer with other officers about like the the sequence of events that happened over at the uh, the casino. I just kind of threw in what I personally saw, and I didn't didn't realize that the uh, the bikes were the same until Marty here kind of reminded me. And then the plates are the same. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. So, are you talking about a casino or are you talking about Legion Square? Because I don't know where this casino part came into play. Uh, the the casino part comes into play because that's where you got picked up by a uh, gray uh, green jacket guy, the one that was riding right. the bike uh, around Legion Square when I initially plate redded. Okay. What? Sure. Okay. Your Honor, I I don't know if this guy can really be a witness. <laughs> not a question, Baka. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, that's not a question or an objection. All right, uh, we're gonna to we're gonna. We're going to refrain from uh, talking about anything that wasn't admitted into evidence. However, the witness can recall from memory if he knows one way or the other, uh, if it's the same. It was, same it was the but same. It will, not be, <laughs> it, will, it will not be treated as, as, as physical evidence. But uh, if that's what you recall and that's the truth, you are under oath. Uh, I will weigh it accordingly. But uh, Mr. Banks, your your objections to this this conjecture is uh, is warranted and has been noted. Um, okay. But let's 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 move on from that. Um, I get the gist of the bike. Okay. And Officer Hawk, are you the individual that apprehended Larry Knox? No, I just I kicked your guys' bike a couple of times and kind of watched as you two were apprehended by my uh, my uh, my lovely teammates. Right, so you were not the officer. You did not uh, collect his radio station either, correct? Correct. I just kind of, I was nearby. <laughs> All right, fantastic. I have no further questions. Thank you, officer. Uh, one uh, redirect question, sir. Mm, I'll, I'll just allow. one. Just one. Officer Hawk, how many uh, freckles does your sister have on the small of her back? Objection. Seven. It's, relevant. <laughs> it's highly relevant. Uh, he challenged Officer Hawk's memory. Objection. I'm showing Your Honor. how good his memory is. <laughs> Your Honor, objection. Um. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna sustain it. I'm gonna sustain it. <laughs> it is seven though, guys. Nice. I, I hit that shit that routinely. Is... <laughs> that will be that will be struck from the record. <laughs> you all heard it. Okay. All right, Mr. Hawk, you may stand down. Thank you, Your Honorable Judge, sir. Thank you for your testimony. Good work. Good work. Okay. Uh, does the prosecution have any uh, other witnesses? And no more witnesses. We'd like to have Mr. Banks' side. Okay. Mr. Banks, go ahead and. Uh, hey, am I good to like rest my eyes for a couple I minutes? Guess, uh, yeah, you're good. Sure. I'll give. No, I will remain in the the bowing narrative position. And, uh, I'm just gonna say liar and baka. All right, my good. narrative. Objection. Yeah, we got a pee. Baka. Well, pee pee. Am I supposed to go up yeah. there and get questioned? Uh, yeah, but you get to give. They they all all their witnesses got to give their uh you know their side of the story in full. We you kind of gave an opening <laughs> statement <laughs> representing yourself. Now you're kind of telling the fleshed out version of the story, then being questioned about it. So, it is your choice. Hey. Uh to waive your fifth Whee! amendment rights however uh and uh, 
subject yourself okay. to cross-examination. So I'd take a moment to think about that before subjecting yourself to that. If you want to just make your argument and have it stand against the testimony, that is your option legally. So it's something to think about. Right. I think in my opening statement, I, I um, laid it out enough for it to be a little obvious on what really happened. Um, Objection. So... I have no, I have no problem with just, uh, you know, getting questioned. I have no problem with that as being, you know, asked right. for clarification. I feel like with the hobbits are flying. So on there is no right. narrative. If you, if you wish to, if you, yeah, if you wish to, uh, just, I mean, uh, I can question on the I, basis I, I, of your original testimony. That's fine. But right. you didn't yeah, testify. If, if officer Aziz Sultan and uh, that officer is also confused, I can just lay it all out again. And, uh, it's just my side. your opening right. statement is not yeah, let's just a do testimony, that. correct? All right. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah should I stand as here? Your Podium. Yeah. Just to be clear, Mr. Banks, you gave your opening more so as your own choice of counsel rather than the defendant. So now you are officially under oath testifying on the record in a court of law. So no everything problem. you say now can and will be used against you here today. Okay. No problem. Take a little sit. Let me stand. I prefer to stand. Now, hello, I am Marty Banks, a victim of the situation that has ensued. Okay, I was at the senior buns, and when I ordered my food, all right, I was walking back right to my car. Two people come up to me, one dressed in the same outfit I'm wearing, but with a rat mask, and another that you guys have identified as Vincent Malone, right? Now, from my point of view, my point of view, right? That's who you identified it as, Vincent Malone, okay? No problem. Now, Vincent comes to me, knife to my fucking neck, says, give me the keys to the Wait, sofa. objection, hold on. What's the thing he said earlier about person sorry, not I'm being sorry, here you, to talk? Can, I'm sorry, can you object or no? Uh, yeah, I, I, I am object. going, I am going to, uh, review this objection, um, because... How is he objecting my testimony? You had the, I mean, we had the opportunity for this witness to be here, and you didn't want him here, so... You can't, right. you can't I not have of, him I and then of, talk kind of for realized, him, Baka. I kind, I kind of realized that, um, I would die. I could potentially die, right? This guy has laid out an entire plan that completely fooled the PD. So I've undermined this person. I wanted to call him down and point him out in his flaws, but I'm really worried that if I walk out of here, I could die right after. And get Objection! Shot, unfair. Stabbed. Unfair. <laughs> um, over overruled. Yeah. All right. Uh, listen, I'm just going to instruct the witness. Uh, as uh, insofar as this witness who was available that you declined after requesting him and having us waiting for an extra five to ten minutes to get him. Uh, I'm going to have you refrain from uh, talking about anything that was discussed between you. You can allege that you were kidnapped or threatened by this person. But beyond that, um, beyond like what you claim you were subjected to, uh, you're going to severely limit, um, you know, what you say about your interactions with them. Understood? Understood. Because he could have been here to testify. Okay. Understood. Right. So once my keys were given to... Two people, right, Vincent and uh, the rat guy, rat boy, I'll call him, right? I sat at the senior buns for quite some time, and after a bit, I was approached by an individual, right, Vincent Malone. I won't say what he said, but um, there were instructions, and in those instructions, it was to dress um objection cheating he's just saying the same thing but different ways all right well i'm how am i going to explain my story right now i i understand for five to ten minutes i did quote unquote waste time but in those five to ten minutes i believe that i may have saved my own life and if that's not how you see it i am apologetic but i can't i kind of have to be a little selfish there you know what i'm saying because it's my life now you may not care for it as much as i do and that's completely understandable because it's my life not yours but i have no other way of telling this story Objection didn't say any of this to any of the officers with guns who could protect him. Uh, where were the officers? Here, oh. in the courtroom with you. Baka. That's fantastic, because you were pointing your finger at me, right? 
So that's why I stopped speaking, and I would like to talk about it here under a court of okay. law. Okay. Okay. This back and forth. This back and forth needs to stop right now. Um, all right. If if Mr. Banks, this is is what you claim. Um, that's fine. I'm gonna I'm gonna take your point, Declan. But uh, I'm just gonna let I'm gonna let Marty Banks tell his story, and you're gonna hey. get to pick it apart. Okay. So we'll just we'll just do it that way. Uh, he can he can make his claims, and if you uh, you, you think they're disingenuous, I'm sure you can ferret that out so uh just just go ahead uh mr bank okay um so in the instructions i was told i said hey I'm hello up, what's up like the individual like his little uh friend i'm good to go i get the bike and as soon as i pick up his other friend his friend is going to take me to where my car is i say fantastic good deal let's let's run this shit up i didn't know it was good I get on the bike. I go to the senior buns. I'm like, okay, perfect. Uh, perfect. Right? It makes sense in my head. Senior buns, where, where the car was taken, I'm going to get it back. Unfortunately, there's like 8 million fucking cops. This guy's on the phone telling me, yo, 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 ba da ba 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 Let's go, go, go. Do it, do it, do it. I get on. And as soon as I, uh, this individual gets on my bike, we're both tased. Go and start fucking flying everywhere. Uh, it is what it is. And soon after, I am apprehended. I'm taken to the cells. I'm not treated fairly whatsoever in the cells. I was punched in the cells by Officer McNulty. And at that point, I decided there is no reason for me to continue conversation. As I proved, I already proved my initial thought was that Los Santos, the police department, they don't care about being right. They care about being right and proving that they're right in the first argument that they make. There's no room for consideration. Not true. Your Honor. No room. <laughs> Mm. And they have proved that today. Mm. Okay? That is my statement. Mm. That is my testimony. Thank you, Your Honor. Thank you. Thank you, officers of the LSPD. Nothing personal. It's just your job. You know, you don't want to get any dap dapper points. It's Mr. okay, Kasey. sir. All right. All right. Prosecution, uh, you may cross-examine the witness. You got a question or you want me to go? I'm sure you have some questions. You, you yes. Could go. Yes, we do. Confused. But, All uh, right. I will say, hang yes. on, before you start, I will say that, uh, you know, I'm kind of going to preemptively strike any sort of specific statements he's claiming was made by the witness who could have been here today. So if you heard anything like that, uh, just don't ask him uh, specifically. About well, I got I got one question. Hey, Marty, uh, you said that you were uh, getting food at Burger Shot, right? That's correct. Why is the burger in your pocket so moldy if you just bought it recently? Uh, I'm not an employee yet, Senior Buns, sir. You might want to ask them, see if they make some fucking dog shit. <laughs> so you just you just left with that? You didn't, like, eat it or anything? I ate it in the cells. Isn't that right, Officer McNulty? You don't need nails? Wait, really? Fantastic. Next question. Fuck. Hey. All right, Mr. Banks. How are you doing today? I'm doing all right. All right, that's it's good to be a lot better. That's good. Let right. me ask you a couple questions pertaining to your statement here today, okay? Uh, one of the questions was going to be me asking about the food. Uh, it's like, you can fashion escape here, for this? but it's okay. He asked oh. and it's answered now. Now, I'd like to ask you a little bit more specifics in regards to the plan as to what happened. Not exactly what was said, but the actions that happened. You were told to return back at Senior Buns, correct? It's time to vehicle? construction, dude. Objection leading. Uh, they can lead. Overruled. Okay, sorry. What was your question? You were asked, right, to return back to senior buns to obtain your sultan, correct? Uh, not exactly that, but more or less. Yeah, that was the first step of the of the uh, of the instructions, correct? And what was the second step of the instruction? To dress up in the outfit that I'm wearing now with a rat mask. When you arrived at senior buns, what did you see? Uh, when I arrived at Senior Buns, when? I was at Senior Buns for quite some time. I went back and forth a few times, sir. You gotta the time be you arrived, specific. The time you arrived when you were on the motorcycle. You go oh, back and obtain your, what, your what I like saw, What I saw, so I pulled up to the front of the Senior Buns. And what I saw was a few police officers uh, with their lights on, blaring. You did and, good work repairing that house? Yeah. Thanks, dude. What were the police officers doing? Thank you, man. 
sitting there. They were just sitting? Yeah. On the ground? Uh, no. On when, the car? Uh, or were they one, sitting? One was on their bike, one was in their car. Just just uh, immobile in their vehicles. Where did I put my planks? They Over have their there. lights on? Yes, sir. Did they have sirens on? No, sir. Were they pursuing somebody? No, at the at the time upon arrival, no. Not in my eyes. Seconds and plugins are used for a rune light. Who got on your motorcycle? I don't know. Um, I don't an remember. individual with the name of Larry Knox. There were police behind Larry Knox when he got on your motorcycle. That's correct. Were they attempting to apprehend him? I don't know. Not at the time, at least. Did you try to drive off when Mr. Knox got on the back? Yes, sir. Wait, he did you have a lockpick on you at any time? Yes, I worked tow. Go, go, go. Run, Giga Man right, 666. No Run! Okay. All right, uh, does Declan have any questions? Declan? Uh... I mean, so just so I'm correct, the statements he made about instructions are like not evidence, right? He, uh, I have acknowledged what uh, what he claims he was he was coerced to doing, but beyond the coercive action that would be criminal in this instance, which he's alleging, uh, any any conjecture getting that's, some good that, grind that on right now, uh, I'm disregarding. Is that is that clear? Yeah, okay, uh, then no, uh, I don't have any questions. Am I able to ask one more? There's there's no proof of him being coerced, so yeah, we're good. He just admitted everything. Cool. I got one follow-up question. That's all right, your other? Uh, yeah. I wanted to ask, where did Mr. Banks obtain these coins? Yeah, we just killed that dude's wife. That were found <laughs> on his person. Um, now, now, it's kind of confusing, right? This may This may be an interesting concept, right? But at the time of me getting on my bike, both me and Larry Knox were tased 13. immediately. Now, I would imagine if someone has a, a thousand coins in their backpack, it's it's not unlikely for coins to start flying around. Okay? So, some coins that may have not belonged to me may have co come into my possession. And I would like to Three, also point 3, out that just recently, I was approved <laughs> for a business license in which it is a casino. And this casino will have slots, roulette, and all of these things. And in our bankroll, we have cash and coins. Now, slot machines, if you're not made aware, take coins. So, I go to the cash exchange every now and then, I and I about go this, uh, and get coins. And evidence. If that is such a revelating idea, and just because, oh, well, I'm a police officer, and I've only seen coins as laundry coins. I, objection, I don't sound like that. that. <laughs> go ahead and sound like go ahead and go ahead and fucking push that. Objection! Relevating isn't a word. I don't really give a fuck. I have a clean fucking record. Okay, I have a clean fucking record. Objection! I'm trying language. To, I'm trying to open a business. Okay. There, I have a gun on me at all times for my safety. The laundromat in your evidence. Why would the robbers use a knife? Against four PD officers, all with guns, if they have a gun. Objection! In that still situation. talking, not answering question. It's ridiculous. Okay. All right. It's ridiculous. All right. This is not a closing statement, uh, Mr. Banks, but this I have noted narrative. that you this are using the uh, Sonic the Hedgehog defense as it pertains to the laundry coins. Uh, which one was it? Was it that they fell into his backpack, or that they're for the casino? That it is uh, quote not unlikely that an electrical charge would cause uh, a bunch of coins to go flying. Hey. Backpack. Not necessarily okay. an electrical charge, right? So when it's mo mo <laughs> individuals on a bike and they're being thrown around, kicked off of bikes like you claimed, Officer Hawk, it's pretty unlikely that a fucking few coins might go fucking loose, no? 40 kilograms few. of coins? <laughs> I would right. say few, okay. maybe. However, I believe you had a total of 3,200. Right. And I also said that I am opening a casino. Okay. I literally got approved for a business license and I need coins for my casino, okay? Okay. If that's, no if that's hard for you to understand, so I which don't one, know So which one you. is it? It's a little bit of fucking both. Is that okay with you? Uh, objection. Pressed. 
<laughs> um, yeah, it's uh, you're on the witness stand. Uh, you're not asking the questions uh, at this time. Oh, okay. Time. All right. All right. Perfect. <sighs> all right. I have no further oh, questions. Yeah. All right. Uh, yeah. So you can go ahead and step down, Mr. Banks. No problem. Uh, I don't think anyone has any further questions. Okay. Um, I'm going to go look over the evidence very carefully against the testimony given here today and come to a decision. Uh, I'll need a bit of time for this. So just uh, everybody make sure to hydrate. Grab some snacks upstairs if you need. Do you, sir? Court is in recess. Mark, do you need food or anything to drink? No, I'm good. Oh, wait. Where are you Marty, going? Remain in here. Hey, Marty. Hey, hey. What, man? What? Where are you going? Oh yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna run away with no phone, with no equipment, nothing, nothing. Oh, nothing. Yeah, gonna, oh the the uh, assistant chief I approved you to ride with me and for me to dress like you with a vest. Okay. Cool. Are you sorry sure about right. that? Just I don't appreciate you didn't say that. Oh, yeah. so they said go walk around, go get food, blah 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 blah. I'm not leaving this building. I am oh. not leaving this building. Aziz, stay with him. Stay with him. He's still in our custody, regardless of what he said. Watch me, buddy. I'm not leaving the building. I just don't want to see have those officers faces, brother. We got Shall Ash we? Chief, Ruby. Good freaking I'm choice. Yes. You look you want. like me. You shouldn't really not look like yes. yourself. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Like... Okay. We'll I head up to a clone store, maybe hours. up north a little bit, and get changed. Okay. Varrock, dude. What the hell? No, not at all. I'm actually uh, at the courthouse right now dealing with a bench trial from a Marty bank. You see the ass to ass chief? Yeah. <laughs> yeah getting, uh, you actually like minion emotes? Yeah, I'm a big minion that. head, dude. Straight up. Straight up! I'm excited for Varlamore? I don't know if I qualify for it. I don't know. I don't freaking know. I'm almost out of planks, dude. I want more minion emotes added. De only if they're good. Can we get some hard base up in this piece? Sure can, bro. Sure freaking can. I need a new mission, dude. Where's my drip? Bro, I don't have drip. I'm poverty, bruh. Bone Saw McGraw, thanks for subbing. Never. Can we get the mini emote with the thong walking as an emote? <laughs> no. I'm about to freaking level, dude. What am I farming contracts for? I'm trying to get the plank sack, dude. But I tried HDOS, all the same plugins too, just more HD. Uh, I don't play this game to make it look HD. In fact, quite the opposite. 59, boys. Mm 
I might have enough planks to actually spam make stuff in my, uh, I just need cloth, I think. I might end up doing that tonight. Make oak larders? I have a, a bunch of teak, so preferably something that teak can make. Oak dungeon doors at some point are good. Are they good for the level 59 lads like me? Gizmo the Gamer. G-A-Y-M-E-R. You can right click to TP outside POH right away. Wait, really? I was wondering if that was a thing. Make the tables. M meow. You're grinding rune crafting right now. Last skill till max. Nice. I like Guardians of the Rift. Ooh. Wait. I know I'm shit. I'm fucking. What's in your. What's in your ball? Uh. I don't know. I think we're kind of just screwed because uh, she very clearly ditched the knife somewhere. We never like recovered it. And uh, she had fully <laughs> changed clothes by the time we found her at her house. So, I mean, look, uh, Cornwood son and Lenny son uh, know this lady and they said they positively ID'd her on scene. She was not wearing a mask. I can confirm that much, but I don't know her. So I, it looks like the same lady to me, but, you know, I don't know. Yo, narcotic cow, dude. Yeah, where you been squat? 